ಹಲೋ ವೆಂಕಟ್ ಹೌ ಯು ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಐ ಫಿಂಕ್ ಕಂಫರ್ಟಬಲ್ ಎಸ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಸೊ ಕುಡ್ ಯು ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ಇಂಟ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಸರ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಫಾರ್ ಗೇಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆಪರ್ಚುನಿಟಿ ಸರ್ ಮೈ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಕಟಿಕ ಮೆಗಡೇಶ್ ಓಕೆ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಬೀನ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ಗ್ರಾಜುಯೇಟೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ಟೆಕ್ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರೀಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರಾನಿಕ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕಮ್ಯುನಿಕೇಶನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಗುಂಟೂರ್ ಮನ್ನೆ ಪೆರ್ಮಾಲು ಎಜುಕೇಶನಲ್ ಸೊಸೈಟಿ ವಿತ್ ದಿ ಸಿಜಿ ಪಿ ಆಫ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಏಟ್ ಕರೆಂಟ್ಲಿ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಡೆವಾಸ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಐ ಡಬ್ಲ್ಯೂ ಎಸ್ ಇನ್ ವಿಕ್ಯೂಬ್ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಪ್ರಾಜೆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡನ್ ಸೋ ಫಾರ್ ಸೊ ಫಾರ್ ಟು ಪ್ರಾಜೆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ so uh, what are those and uh, what are the issues you have faced uh, while working on those projects in the first project i have been deployed the tomcat in the pine instance okay um what are the issues you have faced uh, first of all uh, uh, creating the amis and deployment of jenkins in all the instances has been a god that also okay so um, with the help of our in charges i have been create the rom sir okay and install all the all the jenkins software in instances okay um and what is the use case of second project i uh, email integration sir okay so in that process uh, i got with the problem of parameter sir okay. with the choice parameter uh, during the scripted lines so i have been resolved that with the help of the language sir uh, the problem was uh, when i gave uh, s or no choice parameter even i gave the s parameter also it uh, even i gave the no parameter also it uh, build up in the s parameter on this yes, okay so i got the issue by changing the script in the pipeline script okay, okay. what is different between uh, revert and reset reset is uh, nothing but it is a remote repository sir mm-hmm. one commit changes before the, uh, it will come revert means uh, when we use revert command uh, it will create a new commit and does not change the previous commit id sir okay so what is rebase not is different between merge and rebase which is uh, merging the one branch with another branch okay. rebase is uh, i think that uh, commit id is uh, using commit id fine now uh, what is git amend i mean is nothing but uh, to stop the previous uh, commands we use amend process uh, like coming back to the forward process or ongoing process to stop that mm-hmm. why we use reflock reflock to uh, see the deleted uh, uh, commits uh, to see the deleted to commits pick the deleted uh, particular commit id so we use the reflow uh, but what about cherry pick for particular uh, commit id we use sir uh, we can see reflow uh, deleted commits to not de- is it for deleted commits or the, the, to recover the deleted branch we use reflow which one reflow is used for uh, recover the branches and cherry pick is used for deleted commits commits okay uh, what is stash stash is a temporary memory store storage sir uh, while we are working on one branch suddenly an, uh, another work we have to do uh, we will not commit the id of uh, that branch so it will store in temporary stash okay so that's one stash storing this in is temporary storage fine uh, could you please write sample uh, docker file for me sorry jenkins file for me the pipeline and could you please use when condition in this when condition when condition fine so explain the step so this is the basic syntax okay so pipeline agent and from here we will take the stages mm-hmm. what are the process we need to do the mm-hmm. first process is cloning the repository or the code which mm-hmm. is we want to mm-hmm. so the second one is maven validate mm-hmm. which is a source code uh, maven is nothing but a build tool mm-hmm. which is a uh, a human understandable language converts into a uh, machine can understand language okay. so it's a main is a java and okay. we can convert into any other languages also in this manner we will compile and test the cases so okay. the code is uh, ready or not fine um there are a lot of derivatives for example instructions okay. like we have a lot of from run copy have you heard about this okay, the okay. okay. fine um what you know about docker basically what are the concepts docker is, uh, docker is nothing but a container a container virtualization software with this we can deploy and less the storage amount by using a uh, docker containers and docker images fine anything i mean uh, uh, not comfortable in docker right yes so what is the difference between polysium peer to peer and webhook polysium is uh, when the uh, the process is very much it will uh, intimate to us and replay uh, 
and uh, periodic build means whether the uh, code is built or not at that uh, time or particular date we have been set it mm -hmm. will uh, automatically update it mm -hmm. whereas webhook means whether we, uh, the code is built or not it automatically update it webhook whatever in webhook whether it will or not uh, it will automatically update it seriously Spo uh, build or not automatically update or spontaneous spontaneous 